on the bench today we have a Shark vacuum cleaner. It's actually one of the two we have um, at home and the button internally, the, the lever that clicks the on off switch. Um, the snap back off. I had done a previous repair to this um, by gluing this part back on. And that's what sits in, in the gap. The other end, that end, hovers over the switch and obviously when you press the outer part it clicks it. <coughs> um, I could just re-glue it again but I don't think that's the the best solution longer term so what I'm going to try this may not work either um, is I've got a bit of um, thermal pad um, I was going to use just blue tack I don't think blue tack's conductive in any way but I don't want to take any any chances so my plan is I'm going to stick this into the gap um, for the little lever to go on top of but I'm also going to add um, a little bit of blue tack on top of that just to hold that in place because it would be quite loose otherwise um, so that would be the idea um, let's put that like that then get this in place here make sure it sits down enough and then another bit of blue tack a nice flat piece over the top of it all so it definitely sticks in place and it's not going to shift and then a little bit in here because one of the, the bits that secure it in and then it's snapped off and gone so I should be able to slip that back into place I think that's clicking away only one way to be sure just to plug it in and try it Right, here we go. Is it going to come on? The button sits a bit lower um, than it should. It's, it's not the perfect fix, but unless you can actually replace the whole top plastic section, um, this is probably the best you're going to do. Um, had a similar issue with our newer model, um, uses the same style of buttons. Uh, it hadn't snapped off completely but it had cracked, um, so the button started feeling quite spongy, you were having to push it a little bit harder. Um, so with that one I actually popped it open and just stuck blue tack over the top of it just to give it a bit of support and it's worked perfectly ever since. So if you do have one of these shark Okay, camera cut out there. So if you have one of these sharp vacuums and you're having problems with on off switch and you're beyond the warranty period, it's just a case of flip, getting, getting a, a flat tool, a screwdriver works, flip the, the top part off um, and do something similar to that and it'll get back up and running. Um, so yeah, quite happy with that. Uh, if you liked this video found it helpful informative then please click the the thumbs up if you want to see more like it <coughs> um, then please do subscribe it's appreciated and I'll catch you on the next one